Ah, look, just what we've been looking for. A damsel in this land. Let's see, I'll try to pick her up. She ain't mine, but she looks fine. Gonna take some time, gonna make her mine, gonna make her mine. Yet, you're the law. Me as a Joseph, I'm from Canada. How are you, Kagdila? Um, хорошо. Old guys and how you guys can pick up girls in Ukraine is the topic of this video. You guys always ask me, how, how much of an age gap can I pull off, Joe? 10 years, 15, 20, 25, 30, you know? And the thing is, it's different for every man. Well, street is the real deal, right? There's no scammers. Well, I won't say there's no scammers, but there's few scammers on the streets. Most Ukrainian ladies are good old fashioned, you know, traditional ladies, and they're not out to scam you. So whatever you can pull off on the street, that's real, which means you get her number, she'll engage you and meet with you and date you afterwards. That is an age gap that works for you, that you can pull off. That's the best way to answer that question for you. Yeah. When you pick up lady, she basically read from, you know, not what you say. She, she see whole picture. How you stand, you know, if you're confident position, how you dress, what is, how you smell, what kind of charisma, what's your voice, you know, so many factors, everything at, at one time. And she come with her decision in, a, in a five seconds, if she really would like to know you or like she, she's not completely not interested, you know. And your budget is far better off spent, I promise you. Just getting your butt to Ukraine and hitting the streets and you know, getting some coffee dates than it is playing fantasy football online. Because the whole online thing, guys, it's a ruse. Never send money or spend money online. Just come to Ukraine, you're far better off. And remember, guys, every month we have our $10,000 lifetime matchmaking giveaway. And it's so easy to enter to win. Everything that you need to do just to subscribe to our channel, comment below this video and share it on Facebook. If you don't have Facebook, share on any social media you have, but make sure later you can prove it, okay? And then come back every last Saturday of every month and I will, using software, listen on air, draw the winner. It may be lucky you. <laughs> we thought we would shoot you this video talking about, you know, can old guys be successful picking up girls in Ukraine is the title of this video um, because Anne and I of course have an age gap actually 20 year age gap right and we met if you remember on street pickup I picked her up originally two years ago in front of Ocean Plaza Mall in Kiev I didn't realize it was pick up actually <laughs> yes I was cunning yes, debonair and sly you were wearing you remember babe what you remember I remember oh <laughs> <laughs> it was a flared out mini skirt or something like this and you were wearing Not your short. clogs. Now you're in running awesome. shoes because we're married. Hey guys, <laughs> check out the shoes. It's a <laughs> How many times on average in a given day do guys try to pick you up in Kiev? Many. If I spend time in the center, it's like from five to ten guys per day. Ooh. And so how many guys before me Wink, wink. We're successful getting your phone number, for example. Mm, I don't remember actually even one time when I gave. don't remember. Very convenient. No, one Very time. Nice. No, when I gave telephone, I say uh -huh, so. Uh -huh. Not one time. I mean, one time I gave telephone when a uh, guy was so much uh, perceived, you know. So much what? pursue to get my number you know uh -huh. push me and like uh -huh. didn't let me go until i you know uh -huh. give him number and the result was that he when he called me i just didn't pick up the phone okay so how many before me approximately be honest got your phone number before me well, this guy on Th that was it so guys that should tell you something and of course we have a 20 year age gap you guys know that right so honey talk about age gap um how was i successful oh I mean, what did I do right? Help guys out. No, first of all, I didn't realize it's a uh, pickup. I remember I was uh, like really charmed by Joseph charisma from when he started to talk to me, his voice, his smile, his position, you know, all, all that thing small. I mean, later when I tried to analyze what happened. <laughs> so I, I came up with, you know, so many things uh, together click in my head and it's happened to every lady, you know. And what did I do differently? 
that was a no, basically you just ask for help so it's very natural you know <laughs> tip number one guys <laughs> asking for help is slick they don't see it coming it's still pick up why does it work babe um, because many ukrainian ladies they are uh, very sincere and very happy to help you you know if they be very friendly open nations you know friendly to foreigners guys we understand not much people not many people talk speaks english you know so it's very often guys need help so they're happy to help so you know you said a key point you said that other guy that was pushing you gave him your phone number just to get rid of him yeah yeah and let's give guys tip number two about street pickup just because you get the girl's phone number does it mean does it mean she likes you um, no, no. She can then go on a silent mode, you know, just, uh, you know, she don't want to offend you. But I'm, I'm that person that, you know, I normally didn't tell guys, you know, like, oh, look at you and look at me. I wouldn't give my number. No, I do it very polite, you know, but not every lady knows how to do that, you know, not to make feel guy bad you know yeah For they example, just don't want to offend right yeah don't want they, to offend they, they don't know how to refuse so they gave number but then you know don't respond you know? and and what they can do is just not reply to you when you message her mm -hmm. on viber whatsapp later or just ghost you mm -hmm. and in fact let me share with you guys some inside uh insights i know a guy in kiev he, american guy he's pushing 70 okay he does street pickup every week i was gonna say every day but at least every week i mean he, it's his favorite pastime hobby i think and so he's almost 70 and he's getting phone numbers of girls that are 30 32. i don't think he goes above 35 very often anyway so you're pushing almost a 40 year age gap and guess what his success rate is 80 percent now do they reply after do, i mean does it do they reply and do they accept dates and do they meet with him? No, not usually. That success rate, he doesn't tell me. <laughs> Only the 80% phone number success rate. So that's the point, guy. Can old guys be successful on street pickup in, in, in Ukraine? Yes, you can. But what is success? Let's define success. In this video, I, I think everybody should define success as actually starting a relationship, right? That is the end game. Let's talk about us, babe. Um, yeah, a lot of you guys mm -hmm. uh, ask uh, us, uh, like, oh, if Joseph did this, why I cannot do, you know, but... <laughs> yeah, Joseph won the beautiful mm -hmm. princess, unicorn as I call it, why can't you? And what's our answer, babe? No, I said it's not, it wasn't a simple journey for Joseph, for me as well, to accept our age gap, you know, because... Uh, I, I didn't find, you know, I didn't know the age of Joseph and I thought he, he's younger, you know, and as soon as I found out on the first date his age, <laughs> I was yeah, shocked. What happened? <laughs> yeah, I was shocked I cannot accept this. How um, hard did your head hit the table when you fell under the table? <laughs> <laughs> well, I was I wanted to disappear, but I couldn't. Like I have to continue. Did it? It wasn't my face, no. No, no, I didn't. I, no, you 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 hit it very well. A good poker face. I I didn't really pick up on it, guys. But much later in the relationship, much later. But uh, I disappeared for one and a half months. Yeah, <laughs> she's gone for a month and a half. So that's how disturbed she was. So just so you guys know how not normal a 20 year age gap is the average age gap in your yeah, phone is like five to seven five years five to seven right? years it's normal yeah yeah those guys who, who think it's like 20 30 40 it's okay in ukraine no you just brainwashed it's not completely not uh, normal yeah. and not true about ukrainian ladies you you have to accept that you okay to live with the prejudice from the people you don't know if your relatives will be happy with this it was very you know like for me very sensitive and deep question you I, I wanted to be happy you know with my choice and supported by my family guys if either the mother or the father of her is older than you that's that's a deal breaker that's an instant deal breaker the woman you know always come back to us and the Asians say to Tatiana my my mother is mm -hmm. is uh you know younger or same age as him or my father right there that's a deal breaker so that that's one of the issues okay yeah, yeah. 
The other thing is, it's a huge confidence builder because you will be successful coming here and picking up uh, ladies. They're very receptive to it, unlike Western women. I promise you that. And it, it will bolster your confidence, which every man can use here, right? Um, so, just gonna announce that we've been asked to do a street pickup series and give you guys all the tips and tools, basically, you know, the do's and the don'ts of street pickup uh, based on my experience. <laughs> when don't you want? <laughs> <laughs> based on my experience and just everything I've learned in a lifetime. Um, so, we're gonna do that and uh, that'll be hitting the channel here soon. So, we'll see you guys here for the street pickup series. And best of luck. Bye-bye.